What's up, my friends? Kevin here, the Tattooed Toy Hunter, and uh, it's a beautiful Friday. I'm off, and I've decided to start a new series inspired by my love of uh, Star Wars. So every Friday, I want to do something Star Wars related, uh, whether it cover building some type of vintage vehicle back to its former glory, uh, play sets, new pickups, hunts that are inspired by Star Wars pickups, something to that effect. So this week, my, for my first episode of Force Friday, which I'll probably call it, um, I've decided to go ahead and start building the Ewok Village. This is the 1983 Kenner Ewok Village. Not in front of you, of course. <laughs> but uh, I've decided I see a lot of parts on eBay. And, you know, I come across parts from time to time in thrift stores, flea markets. And I uh, decided, you know what, why not piece it together slowly? Uh, aside from piecing the Ewok Village together, I'm going to pick up as many uh, Ewoks as I can. I'm going to show you here. And uh, I'm going to find a lot of loose ones like this. I always do find a lot of loose Ewoks with no accessories. I've decided so that I could have a huge village, uh, Ewok Village full of Ewoks when I'm done. The doubles, triples that I find, I'm going to give them different color schemes to their fur. Customize them, do a little... Uh, painting and stuff give them different you know lines and stripes and whatever So that's the plan. Here's a few that I just I have more than these, but this is what I dug out for a lot of my extras So eventually they will get different colors. So anyway uh, this week I did happen to order some parts For the Ewok village. I got my first two pieces. I want to go ahead and show to you first one's gonna be one of the larger uh, legs of the village. This is the uh, I think the biggest stump, this is the third stump that comes in the set. And uh, as you can see, it's it's very large. Very cool looking. It's in good shape. It's got a little discoloration, but, you know, beggars can't be choosers. <laughs> I got a good deal for it. So as you see, this is uh, stump three. They were nice enough to mark it. So um, every week or two, when I have a chance, I'm going to try to pick up an extra piece and we're slowly going to build this Ewok village together. Uh, aside from this, the large piece, the stump piece, I picked up another uh, piece that goes to the upper platform. I'm not exact, I've never had this, so I don't know where it goes, but for now, I think we're just going to put it, I want to say it's supposed to go in here. Yeah, it is. So that's nice. That's what it looks like, the two pieces together. Fits in good. And we'll just slowly keep building on it. For now, I'm going to put it like this, though. And we will have um, these guys stand around it if we can get them to stand up here. Uh, the Ewok Village has a lot. Uh, a lot of uh, love from me because it reminds me of the original trilogy, the battle for Endor when we have a uh, Wicket and the Ewoks and a major battle go down with the Empire there. Oh, we lost an Ewok. Ewok down. So there's these four Ewoks. Uh, and of course, as we get bigger, as far as the uh, pieces, I find more pieces. We put more of the village together, we'll get it complete. I'll have a huge village and I'll uh, find a spot in my toy room for it and we'll set it up like officially nice looking and all. So to keep this uh, video short, this is gonna be it for my Force Friday video. I've got two pieces of the Ewok village and uh, more to come and here's four characters. I do have a new wicket and a packet we'll open maybe next time when I get my other uh, pieces of the village in. So for now, this is Kevin, the Tattoo Toy Hunter, you never give up that hunt. Pew, 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 pew. Y'all take care.